of the orcs in Conversation Castle because the party's in a different castle. Yay! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> also, there's no king of the orcs. Yeah, it's just the it's chieftain just, of capital. It's just, it's just the chieftains. So anyway, uh, I'm probably gonna you, get interrogated. Uh, hopefully, we'll have had a uh, good time. The well, um, so the yeah, I, I apologize that there is a little more uh, filler. Uh, recently, but uh, I, w I did want to go ahead and give you guys the offer to, you know, buy some magic items, reap the rewards of the uh, shady dealings, and uh, crime? Yeah. crime? Crime was kind of paying. Crime uh, always most, pays. Most, most definitely was, even though Dante was just like pissed off having oh, yeah. to be around the Thieves Guild. Well, well you know, Mara's just people. like these are my people, but on land. Yep. Well, for me, the I'm most... I'm like I may be chaotic good, but I am very good. Like, so I'm not about that. Given that we're past fuck ups with the thieves guild of uh fucking blown up place, it was <laughs> yes, that. <laughs> I keep dropping these little like bits of information on this coffee shop in Shurthor, like. <laughs> Could be burned out. Uh, anyway, I, mean, I went Eric. there all the time, and they all became my friends. But you know, yes. it's a front for the thieves, girl. Uh, how'd you feel about session, Eric? It Questions, was, concerns? It was fine, although I'm still now. I'm just getting more curious about what does it mean. Like, what does the uh, what, what are you does, forgetting? What did you forget? Yeah, what am I forgetting? And why is it very important? Apparently. Mm -hmm. That Starting is to remember in a future session. Yep. It, it is. I, I am planting the seeds for. I don't know. Hopefully, so many future around. sessions. Maybe Nicholas will get oh, his own special. Like episode. how many future sessions are <laughs> yes, planning for? Oh my gosh! Yeah, I mean, hype, but also, oh gosh, there's so much. Okay. I just want to put this out there, uh, with the speed that we are going, I was trying to, like, you know, push things going forward pretty fast, but then it took us four sessions to get started on, like, the, I, I, I usually for sessions have, like, bullet point lists, yeah. and we are on point number two out of, like, ten. Point two, go to fucking Cassell. <laughs> yeah, the and that one's like an optional side thing. You didn't need to stop here if you didn't <laughs> want to. Uh, but so this you know. whole thing goes deeper than just go to Orzur, kill the guy, and go home. I mean, you can think about that. Dante is happy to be along for the ride for all of this, all of these side missions for the other characters. Because well. fuck Gary. Fucking Gary. Uh, I got beef with Gary, but that's it. Mission objective, murder. No, I don't want to murder Gary, but fuck Gary. Okay, we get it. You got a crush on Gary. Chill I want to put Undead to see over Gary. that fucking dream scene. The sheer amount of hate fucking that's going to happen with Gary, oh god. I want to put no, I don't, I don't want to. Yeah. He's, Honestly, Gary, when, Gary's when, when the dream session happened, I was actually very much thinking of DVC abridged. Uh, right? I want to put... Besides, Gary's not even humanoid. I don't want that. Yeah. <laughs> Gary is a catfish. He's a fucking shouldn't... catfish. <laughs> catfish that shouldn't be in salt water. Yeah, a fish that shouldn't be in salt water. Fuck Gary. I did put the <laughs> put two and two together there. It's like wait. Hmm. So anyway, uh, was there anything else you'd like to mention, Erk? Um, not really. The only problem I had was pretty much the same problem most people were having. It was a pretty slow session, but otherwise yeah. it was fine. Just trying to chug the train along, but yeah, yeah. yeah. Anyways. Um... Have a good night. I have a question for you. Eric. Eric. Wait, nope. yeah? Question for Eric. The fuck is in Big Shot? What is what Big Shot? You, oh, what is oh right, the Big dog? Shot Central. <laughs> 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 Don't worry about it. 
This frog dog. Okay. Anyway. Have a good night, Eric. Yeah, you too. Have a good one, Eric. All right, Shane, how did you feel about session? Question, comments, concerns? I mean, I'm I'm pretty content. I just, you know, did my thing, just vibing. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, Sutha and Fengal are no longer hanging out with the party, but it makes it ma it makes it makes Dante sad, but it's okay. Is his job right now is to just incessantly be protective, especially of Zach and Sandra, because those are the two people he likes. What? I'm liked. Yay! <laughs> Dante has, actually uh, like Dante Zach. Has, oh my gosh! It's gonna say Dante also just has an innate obsession with Sandra's ears and shit because it's like God, it's so soft. This is going mm -hmm. to become a habit. <laughs> Yeah, he's gonna keep fucking touching him, he the, can't help it. The problem is, Sandra's probably not gonna stop him. It's just like, oh, you s scritches. <laughs> Plus, Dante would love to learn more about the clown ways, because he likes to learn about other ways of life, and other, like, you know, religious or otherwise, just cultures. He likes to know about other cultures, so he wants to know more. Huh. So I look, I look forward to more of that, for sure. And maybe getting high. <laughs> well, uh, hey, that's hey, 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 Dante can't get drunk or anything, so it's like he's gotta yeah, have some true. way to have fun. <laughs> magical high. <laughs> hey, give me that magical high, baby. So effects uh, may very sacrilege may be occurring. Oh, was there anything else you wanted to mention? Not that I can think of. I'm all just right. chilling, man. Cool. Well. If that is all, then uh, you're free to go if you would like. And B, how'd you feel about session? Questions, guys. Honk. Honk. Yeah, it honk. was very nice. Mm -hmm. I it, it did get slow, like Eric said, but that's more just due to like we just have to go through the motions sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> or I, I, we forget what we're doing. That's why I, I try mean, to in RP try to force force movement. Like I yeah, want or like I come think... on, get moving. <laughs> It's like, okay, just just, just do the thing, please. It's the solution is there. Come on, let's get going. I will actually second you on that. We have been sitting in Boot Rideau for over 10 so seconds now. So I said, it's, it's like, okay. oh god, okay, let's I shop. I am ready to go somewhere. <laughs> but but re re remember, like, like, B, remember, you have buff shark man that can lift anyone and can probably carry two party members at one time. So if it's just like... Just, just grab him. Let's go. I will do uh, it. I am very excited for how many sessions you guys are going to be in Orzir. Because, uh... Much less Cassell at this rate. <laughs> I mean, Cassell either will take an extra session or two, or not that long, depending on which way you want to go with it. But, uh, yeah. It's, it's going to be a good time. Uh, but was there anything else you'd like to mention? Um, no, not really. <laughs> it was fun. Cool, cool. Glad you enjoyed. Uh, Twy. Hello. Uh, how did you feel about Session? Uh, ba, 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 ba. It was nice. It was very, very decent. Uh, I am noticing a problem that's becoming rapidly apparent for myself. Mm -hmm. I have no fucking clue what's going on, and it's hard to be invested. And I and like the fact that things are moving so slow kind of makes that problem a little bit worse. Mm -hmm. Where it's just kind of like, okay, I knew we were going somewhere. That's how I've been this entire session. I had no fucking clue where or why, and it's just like it's all thick and all this like you know just like other stuff that i have no idea what's going on and oh we gotta do this other stuff and oh i gotta check up on these guys and oh, i gotta do this and all like literally I, as i remember the session we were leaving town and it's like oh good we're leaving town oh now you're saying it in and just like no god damn it we were doing something ah and then we just like sat there for a while and then it's just like i'm gonna haze for this stuff man mm -hmm. And so well, they should be picking up nothing. now that we're at the capital. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's zoning out because nothing's happening. Because I can't help that. I really can't. Either mm-hmm. I'm going to look at Twitter or I'm just going to stare at my ceiling just like, uh-huh, this isn't important. If That's I why I do random promote, light role play, like little stuff that just can be ignored by everyone. Yeah, I also do that to keep myself occupied, as you might have noticed. Like, it was just whatever the fuck's going to go on in this inn. I'm just going to make it so that Dante has another one of those moments where he forgets how tall he is and hits his head on something. Yeah. If you yeah, want. No, just, I feel like a new player, basically. Mm-hmm. If you wow. want. Which is only natural. It's my second session, but still. If you want, you can get in Sandra's face about it. Just be like, what is happening? What are you people doing? Because if you let her, she'll tell you all of it. She's well, that's the thing. I feel, like I, just, just, I feel like. I don't know why, but my brain thinks on, haven't I asked what's going on? And I just get a distinct, okay, this can sound weird, but whenever I think about what if asked party, I just have an image of Zack in my head, aka B, just shrugging going, oh. To be fair, that would be what I'd do. (laughs) This is probably because I asked before session what's happening, and it felt like I asked before we're actually joining in on everything. What's actually happening? And I recall not getting a very clear answer. Just a if bunch ne- of if need be, like, if, what's happening? If need be to make it easier, it could be almost like an out, out of character but in character that you and Sandra have a discussion and Hunter can fill you in on all the thingies. Like, See, as feel free Sandra. to lord dump me out of character. In I the would yeah, love like, like to in the lord DM. dump you. Yeah, like in the by, DMs. By Lord Dump, I mean current happening Lord Dump, not Lord of Cinder Lord Dump. Okay, so... Lord of Cinder is newer than your character, actually. Well, I... Okay, so... I'm picking uh, up Dark Souls to, vibes for some reason. TL, to, to TLDR, uh... What, what's the fastest way to say this? You want me to do it? Every orc city has a chieftain. Uh-huh. Uh, if... Y- if someone kills the chieftain, they get to take chieftain. All right. Uh, Dante killed like half of the chieftains, and now oh, not even half. I I killed it, one, and then I killed another. Uh, and one of the chieftains is actually an illithid and needs to die, and tricked the party into fighting Dante, and while Dante was trying to kill the illithid. Illithid is an Ozur, right? That's why he's a yes. Un- yes. Yes. Okay. It turns out that Ozur chieftain is over there, and they're, they are the Mind Flayer Illithid, and it's like, okay. oh, fuck. I yeah, did otherwise... have a vague idea for killing a Mind Flayer or something, or yeah. there's a yeah. Mind Flayer infestation or something. My otherwise, best like... guess on what was going on was, okay, there is probably... A... We're probably warning them or something, or we're gonna go <laughs> find a we're like, player. Yeah. Here? <laughs> Otherwise, for for a quick just like <sighs> recap of what it essentially like, because Dante came in in the middle and had to learn everything from Sandra as well. It's just I traveling dude. I go and I try to fight like you know the baddies wherever I go. Chaotic good. I'm willing to do some crazy fucking shit to stop evil. Ended up, what is it in Ukror? got in a fight with a dude in a in a bar because he was being a complete dickhead misogynist all kinds of horrible things we get in a 1v1 bar fight you know we fight each other pulls out a weapon to try to kill me i go full beast mode murder the man turns out he's chieftain and that's how i learn about the big bad evil and i needed to get to food verdo to tell them about this big bad evil and i'm trying to gain troops and like help and i had stopped at medcon Medcon told me to go fuck myself, and so I had a 1v1 with their chieftain, and he said, no, it's we, one of us dies, and of course, he died. So I now am in control of Medcon, and I went to Chaldrill, where I got attacked by the Adventurers Guild, and the Adventurers, like, guild were just dickheads, and, uh, we fucking wrecked their asses, and then I get the to the Adventurers chief- were adventurers. Yeah, they were stupid as fuck. But I get, I get, I get, I get to the the chieftain there and let them know, like, no, there is a big bad evil thing coming that will destroy literally fucking everything. And the chieftain and Chaldra was just like, oh shit, yeah, dude, I'm on your side, yeah, a hundred percent. And then so we cool. And then I went to Bird Budverdo where I was uh, added to the party, and they got to meet me. I think the adventure guild thing was partially my fault. Could be, but yes, the, everyone thought that I was some invading thing when literally I didn't even ask to be a chieftain. I wasn't I, trying to be. Um, 
I sent a letter to the Chaldral Adventure Guild. And, like, to expedite it getting there quickly, I gave them, like, five gold for, like, overnight shipping. It was insane. And it was... I don't remember the exact... Money bags over here. <laughs> I don't remember the exact words. It was something along the lines of, give us whatever help you can in trying to take out, uh, Ukror, and, uh... We will tell you who blew up the adventure guild. Okay, so quick TLDR about everything. Just be one minute, sure. We're gathering up resources to go kill an elephant, correct? Yes. yes. Okay, that's all yes. I need to fucking know. <laughs> Just making dude, sure I've got but, the but, plant down. But dude, the very first thing that I got to fight and I grappled and was holding, <laughs> like hugging, was a mind flayer. They feel funny. The tentacles like don't feel pleasant. Well, it was, at first it wasn't uh, one, but once it went to its true form while I was fucking grappled to it, I was just like, oh, oh dear. Tentacles. Yeah, you I don't like know. tentacles, you fucking... <laughs> you know, I don't think I actually mind-blasted the party with that illithid, but... Uh, regardless. No, you just you fireballed something. Us. Yeah. You certainly rolled something, and then I don't think anything happened. I think it was really just the disguise. <laughs> anyway, uh, hey Hunter, how'd you feel about session? Questions, comments, concerns? Oh, this was a heavy one. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Almost like uh, I, 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 we had a solo session and I did something serious to your character. Uh, you dropped a fucking bomb on me and made me climb yep. up the snake eater ladder. <laughs> yep. It's okay, Hunter. Big Buff Shark Man was here to keep it, you safe and hold you. Then you got bit by the uh, iguana snake that gave you petrification. That was not fun. <laughs> yep. Uh, I like cards on the table. I had no idea what <laughs> I was gonna do with that. By the way, mm -hmm. I was like, Fucking okay, maybe beef. this will end up fixing itself, or maybe not, and I'm completely fucked. Okay. This is happening. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, then it was just uh, three, four days of me just thinking about that. Like, okay, how do I word this to the rest of them? Because there's no, there's no reason for Sandra to hide this. She's the most brutally honest character in the party. And, uh... Basically, yeah, but just went through a fucking character arc. Uh, you're stuck with Sandra. <laughs> oh, be like that. Well, like, she's just, she's constantly being like, maybe I should leave. I mean, that happens sometimes when certain characters don't mesh super well. <laughs> we were just like. So she like, does need to go home, though. Fix the meshing stuff, yeah. <laughs> like, it, it doesn't have to be immediately after we finish in Orzer, but she does eventually have to go home and explain some shit. Yeah, I am more or less... Like, since you guys started at, like, level 4 or 5, I don't fucking remember. It was 4. But, uh, y y like... There was no early level, like, set up, here's the, you know, you're fighting the cultist that will later become the big bad, yada yada. Like, there wasn't any of that, so I'm just like... Alright, well, I just need to start fucking throwing shit at the party, because you're already, like... You're already kind of tough shit, so now I just yeah. need you to piss off some greater powers so that I can actually have something to throw at you. So... You know, dragon. Dragon. Man, fuck dragon. Terrifying. And, uh, yep. I was so ready to roll a fucking history check and be like, oh boy, I get advantage on that because... Pretty sure enemy. we can't take one of those yet. <laughs> yeah, uh... If I do recall, that, that dragon breath... And that dragon breath would instantly destroy anyone in the party. It does like, like 96 damage. It, it, it will drop uh, just about everyone and probably kill a couple party members outright. I think I have something yeah. for that, actually. One sec. Yes, it's called dying. Uh, no. It's something in my favored enemy thing. 
Advantage on saving throws against spells and abilities used by favored enemy. Nice. Out of curiosity, I'm it pretty would, sure... It would hmm. cut the damage in half. It would still probably down me, but I would survive. Maybe. It didn't run. Magic, magic effects like breath attacks aren't counterspellable, right? Oh, yeah, no. They, it's not magic. Okay. Just for you. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> Just check double check it. But if, mm. if the dragon starts casting a spell, then yeah, definitely you can. I but feel like... There are options. I feel like we could take a young dragon, but like... Oh, totally. Probably. Not a red I've, I've oh, sent yeah. I've sent young dragons against my brother a lot, and it's like, that's not that difficult. Yeah, but like... It's just, you know, when they get the big dragons, they're effectively CR24 and shit, where it's like hazardous for everyone right now. I, I actually, legit, am quite eager to fight one. It's my favorite enemy, and that favored shit is just sitting there doing nothing on my character sheet. We'll yep. see how it go. And the, you can detect if there's a dragon near you anyway, right? I have advantage on survival checks to track them, as well as on intelligence checks to recall information about them. Begin the knowledge on how to fuck do we kill a major dragon by killing small ones first. Maybe that's how the arm works. I gotta kill other dragons. <laughs> and absorb their power like the Dovahkiin. <laughs> oh no. The, the secret is that you must kill more bosses. Oh my god. I'm like, I know that eventually this arm is gonna do something. No, it's just for decoration. I highly doubt that. You've already said it does other things. <laughs> nah, I changed my mind. It's just for decoration. No. Uh, <laughs> she is going to be constantly trying to figure out how to get it to stop glowing. Because <laughs> it's just like, wow, this is inconvenient, isn't it? Ugh. <laughs> uh... Two quivers now. Now just wait until you tumble down a hill and <laughs> all of your arrows fall out of your quivers. Yay, the glory of ah oh, fuck, I have no ammo. <laughs> that's when the daggers come in, right? Yeah, that's where the daggers come out. Oh no, the daggers fell out too. Those are holstered. Good. They're kind of <laughs> buckled in there pretty good. Seat planning is important. <laughs> what? And then you get polymorphed into a turtle. But, and then you're fucked. <laughs> okay, Sandra is not related to a fucking dragon. <laughs> I, like, I'll, I'm gonna just put this out there right now. Sandra is not related to a dragon. Okay, just, just make it sure. It's that. just sometimes, yeah, sometimes the language sometimes, being used is like, mm, okay, just but are you I know, sure? <laughs> just because I know draconic does not mean I'm related to them. Okay. <laughs> No, it's the arm. It's the arm, and you finally awoke, and it's like, oh the whole no, thing the you finally awoke, and you're like, like hmm. the, the way I, I sit, like, that whole elaborate dream sequence started with her village being destroyed, which I told the party, this isn't anything new. So I'm starting to think that that was back in time. Maybe. That was There's always one way to past. check, but um, we'd want to hedge a lot more than just a straight try again. No, I don't want to go through that shit again. I almost yep. died. <laughs> uh. All right. I didn't almost die. I got hit like once. <laughs> I probably would have died, though. Hmm. You know, I could have gotten Polymorph. Apparently I have an invocation for that. Mm. But I was like, nah, maybe I'll do something else, because I didn't really want to have a one sh <laughs> have half my spells with Polymorph, but like, yeah, maybe. Polymorph is good. Yeah, but like, the check for it seemed like, you know, maybe, maybe some other time. Mm. Polymorph is good, though. Yeah. 
Bleh. Anyway, I need to go to bed. Yep, it is sure, late. Sure, buddy. Tired. I, Maybe and I, need, and I need to leave for a bit. The EMT <laughs> needs me. Lee has been sitting in the in the op chat yeah, all by he herself has been for sitting like there ever four since, hours. I feel uh, really I'm like, bad. I'm like eighty percent certain that Lee fell. Lee has been sitting I don't know. there ever since we left you know, Boot for Dope. Yep. Say hi. Uh, Might as well. I have to go and see if I'm needed to be the second EMT because EMTs like can't be alone. You need at least two people to run a truck. Oh, you mean your uh, RP thing? Yeah, the RP thing. He he was left alone. He's like, dude, I need you now. And I'm like, I cannot just leave a session. Like, <laughs> I, dude, I'm like, dude, I can't. Bye. <laughs> all right. I'll, uh, all right. Well, you have fun. I know that that's helping. You. I'll, uh, yeah, that I'll, feels good, and I'll, uh, and I'll go ahead and uh, bring this episode of Conversation Castle to an end. Thank you all so much for watching, listening, sharing in this experience, these adventures that we're all having. Uh, we'll see you guys again in two weeks at the next Conversation Castle. Or I don't know, however long the next session goes. Whatever it may be. It depends. Um.